Hey guys, I just wanted to do a really short and random uh, video because I finally figured out. <laughs> um, okay, so let me just explain how I got this backpack. So, some of you know that I am a subscriber to Once Upon a Books, a book club, excuse me. And uh, one of the boxes that they had, it's pretty pricey because you get really good stuff. Um, I think it's like $72.99 or something like that. So you get four gifts in the box. So this is the book that's part of that box, Raiders of the Lost Heart, which I really liked. So um, this is a steamy book, <laughs> just to give you a heads up. So um, yeah, so one of the gifts that was part of this box is this really pretty purple backpack. Um, I know I'm a really bad angle of showing you this whole backpack, but I mean, really, there's only one part of the backpack I really want to talk about and show. Um, one of the features that I do like about this backpack is um, this, what do you call it, outlet? <laughs> I don't know what you call it. Um, you can put your headphones and your charger, and if I open the bag inside... It has these uh, other wires that you can connect, whether it's to your phone or uh, your charging, who knows what. So that's one of the cool features of this backpack. Now, this is the part of the backpack I really want to talk about. <laughs> it took me, so I finished the book like early April and I was trying to figure this part out. I'm like, I've never seen this on a backpack, okay? And I'm like, what exactly are you walking? Be I mean, and I'm like, you know what? Let me just figure this out later. So I finally decided to really look at this backpack, okay? So um, there's this button that says push, and as you can see, it's locked, so it doesn't go any further. Um, so for demonstration purposes, I'm going to put it on zero because I set it on zero. So let's put it on zero and it unlocks. Okay. Now, the first thing I figured out was how to put in a code. So you put it on the number that unlocks it and then you uh, hold your thumb on the press button and then you pick, let's say, let's just go with all twos. So I'm going to make it 222, two, two, and then I unlock it. And then it's, it's going to keep it unlocked. It's on the correct number. But if you change the numbers up, it's locked. So that's the first thing I figured out. Okay, so I realized this is the coolest feature I've ever seen on a backpack. So there's two zippers, right, to open and close the backpack. And there's two locks. So I'm like, okay. I think I know what this is for. So let's put it on 222. Two, two. Okay. And then you put, sorry about the shakiness. Okay, so you put in, hold on. I think I, wait, is it? Okay, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Okay. So <laughs> that wasn't the correct way to do it. So let me unlock it. So you leave it unlock right and then you click in the zipper and then you do the other one so it's completely locked so then when you change the numbers you can't unlock it but then when you put it back on the correct numbers it unlocks look feature of a backpack if you see a backpack that has this feature I definitely recommend you get it because this is going to be like my new um, carry-on backpack <laughs> um, <clears throat> what I also love about it, it has book lover right there but to me this is the best feature I've ever seen on a backpack so I just wanted to share that with you guys if like I said if you ever see a backpack that has this type of lock mechanism for your backpack this is the best, like, especially if you're going over, you know, uh, if you're going to other countries, 
especially like the Philippines or Europe, you know, when there's a lot of thieves and scammers or who knows what. I mean, this is the coolest, coolest thing. So anyways, thanks for watching. Just wanted to share that with you guys. Bye.